Now, the director of the International Monetary Fund, Christine Lagarde, is visiting the three African countries this week. She's starting with the Central African Republic. She will go to Uganda and eventually on to Mauritius. Madame Lagarde arrived in Bongi, that's the CAR's capital, on Tuesday. CGTN's Ucho Koronko is in the CAR. She filed this report. Now, the Central African Republic's capital, Bangui, will be Christine Lagarde's first stop on her African tour, which may come as a surprise to some. The world pays little attention to this small Central African nation, made up of just about 4.8 million people. Now, not only is the CAR one of the least developed economies globally, a violent religious conflict over the last four years has wreaked havoc on its already fragile economy, an economy which relies largely on its agricultural sector, subsistence farming and forestry make up about 55% of its GDP. The country is also largely endowed when it comes to minerals, minerals such as diamond, uranium and gold. However, only its diamond sector has been exploited. Uh, diamonds make up about 60% of its export earnings. Now, the IMF is largely positive on the future of this economy. It says economic progress has been made. It expects uh, GDP growth to be about 5.2% in 2000. 2016, largely due to its cotton, uh, coffee and forestry sectors. However, going forward, the country will be relying on a $115 million IMF program, which was agreed on in July. And that is why Christine Lagarde is here to check in on the economic progress made so far and to discuss with the president and his administration on the way forward. Ucheo Koronkwa, CGTN, Bangui, CAR.